Hi everyone, uh, Georgia Henry here for those of you that don't know me and I was lucky enough to coach the under 12s netball team this year for the Kahuna Kangas. Before I get into the girls and how the season went I just wanted to say a few thank yous. So firstly I want to give a big shout out to Tegan Reed, who was our team manager. Um, Teagues did get injured part way through the season but that didn't hinder her helping me at all. Um, especially in the start of the season when there was a lot of Backwards and forwards, sorting out if we had teams or not, um, sorting out our quite a large number of 14 girls, as well as in the season managing all through the COVID restrictions and stuff like that. Teagues was a great help, so thank you so much for helping me with that, Tegan. I'd also like to give a big thanks to all the parents and guardians of everyone helping out throughout the season, whether that was game day duty, setting up the courts and stuff like that. And a, a special shout out to Tana, Alex and Case, as well as Tegan. These few mums were most of our trainings also helped out whenever I needed with training so it was a bit hard sometimes to juggle the 14 girls so I really appreciate your guys' help throughout the season it made my work a lot easier for training so thank you for that all right and now for our team this year and how we went this season um starting off we had only six numbers at first originally signed up and then by round one we had a total of 14 girls eager to play uh this consisted of Evie McKenzie Bella Douglas, Tilly Matthews, Isabella Williams, Pitt Reed, Isabella Bishop, Shay Taylor, Emmy Easton, Lainey Spring, Edie Power, Mill Crichton, Addie Taylor, Sienna English, and we were lucky enough to have Isabella Parker for a few games when she was up. It wasn't until after round one against Barron when I sort of thought to myself, what had I gotten myself into coaching 14, 10 and 11 year old girls who had never played netball or had much net and netball experience before? Uh, it was quite a different experience to the netball coaching I did a couple of years ago with girls who had played the previous year and had that exposure to that kind of netball and the kind of skills that were involved with that netball compared to the netter that they were used to. Um, but from this, our trainings, we went back to basic netball. We went over, we started with the rules and we worked up from there. And then I think it was just improvements every week. Myself and all the mothers had seen. Um, from our first few games where the girls weren't really scoring, not really sure on the rules of sort of the umpires calls and stuff like that. And we had quite a few steps and like silly little mistakes that we weren't sort of aware of the rules. So um, yeah, so as I said, our trainings changed a lot to more basic netball and going over the rules and stuff like that. And then I think as the season progressed, they were just constantly making improvements getting to know the rules a lot better and then it was it got to about halfway through the season when I'd sort of looked back and realized how far the girls had come they'd got the ball from one end of the court to the other without stepping which was an amazing achievement for those girls um, and then moving forward into the last few games of the season where we had several interruptions with lockdowns and stuff um, our last couple games were absolutely amazing the girls had improved out of sight from their first games all us parents were sitting there getting so excited whenever we'd score a goal because a goal to us felt like a win. Um, it was so exciting to watch the girls improve every week and all the girls should be so proud of how far they've come in their netball. It's so exciting to see how far they've come just in one year. Um, and being so young, they'll be in that team for another two or three years. So it'd be awesome to see how far the girls can go in a couple more years. And with all that being said and done, I just want to give a last shout out to all the girls. I want you all to know of how proud I am of you and how far you have all improved, every single one of you guys. Um, you made game days and training so enjoyable and I was so happy to be your coach and I would love to do it again someday soon. Thanks.